Okay, I'm gonna try to do this really fast. So I'm not gonna go through the whole thing. Um, so normally I would have you start laying uh, face down and um, kind of go through like warming up all the muscles. And then I would use the um, tool, the myofascial tool to go over the right erector spinning group of muscles here on your back. Um, and of course I've already done like muscle assessment and stuff before we started. Um, so normally your right hip was forward, or sorry, your left hip was forward and your right hip was back. So I would work on stretching this, um, the right back side <laughs> and the left front side. Um, so after I did this and went through um, hamstring and everything over here, um, I go over to the left side. Not step on any dogs and um, do hamstring and glutes on this side. And then I would um, do the hip flexor stretch on this side. So I put your quad on my knee and have you squeeze your butt and push down into the table, which activates your glutes and it stretches your hip flexor on this side. So we would do that a few times. And then I have you turn over. Really? Echo, go lay down. Turn over on your back. Thank you. And then on this side, we would do some active stretch on your hamstring. So you would push down against me. And then relax. Go up again. And relax. And then on this side, Sorry, that's your left side. Ha, ha. So the, the I guess the one thing that we were talking about um, on text yesterday. So I was actually um, on the wrong side. So your right side, I would be doing your hamstring on this side. It's your quad, um, probably using a myofascial tool um, up your quad here and doing the ice cubian stretch for your Cross this way and you push your hip down into the table this way so you're kind of resisting against me. Good job. Okay. <laughs> All right, go again. Do that a few times. Relax. Um, come back over here and I'm going to do it actually on the other side so you can see what I'm doing a little bit better because I had to put the phone over there to record. So I'm taking my hand um, and going into like your hips, <laughs> into your uh, your hip, and palpating for your psoas. <laughs> and so when I would find that spot, you bring your knee up like this, flex your foot, and extend it out. <clears throat> Okay, so and then I'm pinning that while you're doing that. I won't use pressure. <laughs> Bring your knee up, flex your foot, out, and down. And so if iliacus is involved, <clears throat> you would just bring your knee up to at an angle like this and back down. So it's a little different place to pin in your hip, but you bring your knee towards me and then back down that way. I hope you can see that. So you're coming like at an angle and then back down. Um, the other thing, which again, this is gonna be on your left side. I'm just showing you on the other side because you can see what I'm doing. But I'm gonna hold your adductor in here and you're gonna roll your leg in towards me. And then I'm gonna come back 